Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Ekroth's Adventures in Skyrim. We are now headed to High Hrothgar to speak with the the Greybeards, the Whitebeards, Gandalf. What? <laughs> Here we are, going up to uh, to High Hrothgar. Time to time to get off Shadowmere. Shadowmere, chill out on the stairs. Why don't you do a couple laps? You you could use a you could lose a few lbs, Shadowmere. Yes, you could. Hi, Hrothgar. Here we are. Continuing along the main storyline. I was informed that there is not a lot of combat in the coming up portions of this main quest line. I hope that's not true. I would be deeply sad. And if it is, though, you know, who knows? Maybe we'll get some epic adventure. Maybe Ekroff could steal a thing or two. How about he steal something right now? What about these fools? What are they gonna what are they gonna do if I take something? Like this it look, this idiot can't even see me. <laughs> I'm gonna take the plate. Ah, uh, you think about that. How are you gonna eat your biscuits now, huh? Yeah, I didn't think so. All right. Proceeds well, Dragonborn. Yeah, thanks. Sky. I God. need to learn to shout to defeat Alduin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Listen. Does it matter? Really? Yes. For matters of such gravity, we need to know where you stand, or who you stand with. All right, well, I have nothing to hide. The blades helped me find out about it. The blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their As do we all. Knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Well, what's the deal you here? Have nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the blades to be used for their own purposes? I'm trying to defeat the bad guy. What... What are you talking about? The blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? Crazy greybeard. What I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? That is not really an option. Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If All right. the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. You've been drinking too much of the Kool-Aid. There. RNG, yeah? No, not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. Alright, dude. Oh, yeah. Whatever. What the heck are you guys doing? The heck? What the heck was that? These guys doing that? Talk to him again? Uh, forgive me. I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my judgment. Master Einarth reminded me of my duty. <laughs> the decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. Okay. What the heck just happened? So, can you teach me this shout? No. I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. Oh, okay. It is called Dragonrend. But its words of power are unknown to us. You're just an idiot. Do not regret this loss. Dragonrand holds no place within the way of the voice. I thought you knew all the words of power. Oh, what else is there? What's so bad about Dragonrand? Mm -hmm. If the shout is lost, how can I defeat Alduin? Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question. If he so chooses. Directing me to Parthenax. Why haven't I met? I need to speak with him. You weren't ready. You still aren't ready. What? Come on. But what do I need to do? Thanks to the blade. Send me on a quest. I'll complete it for you. I have questions that only Parthenax can answer. <laughs> Why haven't I met him yet? Let's get he on with it. in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. Grant me such privilege, then. Give me the top of the mountain. Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Sounds good. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Arngier, let me learn this shout. So I can go to the top of the mountain and talk to uh, Prometheus. <laughs> that was his name, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's something. Is there anything to take here along the way? Can I? Is he really gonna. Oh, shoot. He sees me. There we go. I will take the goat cheese. <laughs> None the wiser. 
None the wiser, indeed. Hey, uh, would you happen to have some goat cheese, Wolfgar? Oh, you're fresh out? Hmm, that's odd. How odd. All right, here we go. Here we go. And a nice little, uh, nice little train here. We make our way to the top of that. Now, I tried to go up there before that crazy blinding snowstorm. I'm guessing the shout that we're learning is going to teach me how to pass that. Kind of do wish these guys would hurry up, though. In other news, the website... Actually, they'll probably be up by the time you watch this video. If the website is not up by the time you watch this video, then the website is just nearly ready. So that is excellent news. Uh, I'm very excited about that, and hopefully you guys will take a visit. Of course, if it's not up yet, then just wait another day or so. Yes, please, Wolfgar. Show me. Anyone. For the love of God, just show me. You? Follow me. I will show you how to open the path to Parthenex. <laughs> Win. Guide. Yeah, okay, so... Look. Look. That was it? Really? Alright. I got it. Look. Oh. Ah. Alright, this one. Oh, cool. Oh, yes, this is great. I still haven't learned this one. There we go. Learn that one, and then this last one here to learn it. You learn things by standing on top of them. Of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Thank you very much. Okay, so now I've learned. Now I have learned to open up the door there. Not really a door. It's more like a an obstacle. Don't worry. The path to path is it is not that perilous, I'm sure. All right, so let's take a take a quick gander here. Go into magic items and shout. Clear skies. Let's go ahead and toss that on the favorites list. Clear skies. <laughs> ah, yes, 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 yes. Let's go. Said the path was perilous, huh? I don't. I'm not. Uh, I'm not catching that here. What? Is there supposed to be something? Is this? Okay. There we go. Wonderful. Wonderful. Well, this is certainly a difficult quest. You have to just do this every couple minutes. Oh, this is so hard. So involved, difficult. All right, let's keep going. You know those stone structures? Those are used upon real mountains to mark the way. Ah, look at that. No, don't go, oh no. That poor little elk, or antelope, or deer. That poor creature just ran straight into the mist. Oh, oh my gosh, that's the perilous thing we were talking about. Get, get the ice wraith. Ice wraith meet fire. Oh, oh, oh kill shot. That was uh, that was weird though. That really didn't look the way I expected it to. Where did he go to? There he is. All right, nice, 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 nice. I was hoping for some sort of an obstacle here. A little disappointed without any. I'll just keep my bow out though, just in case. Come across another one of those fools. Actually, we got something coming up right here. Here we go. There it is. Ice Wraith. Come on, man. What are you thinking here? Where's the kill cam when you need it? As if that really needed it. Don't need anything from the goat. Give me anything besides Ice Wraiths, because those guys are kind of wimpy. Anything at all. Hmm? Yes, no. No. Nope. Nope. Nothing. Man. Ekroff. What is up? This adventure is easy mode for you, huh? I was told these things disappear after a short time, so. Oh my gosh! Hello. That was, uh. That was stupid. Goodbye, Ice Wraith. How did 
I not see him? I guess he kind of blends in with the background. Just a wee bit. Oh, don't. Calm down. What is this thing, by the way? It's a goat? Mountain goat? Billy goat? Bobby goat? Can't see any ice wraiths. Can't see any ice wraiths. However, they probably are here. So, uh, the last one took me by surprise. We shan't let that happen again, shall we? No. No, we shall not. It's pretty much been one at every single pass. I don't even know if there has been a pass without one. This might be it, though. Don't see it. Still don't see it. All right. Guess we're fine. We can keep running. It's going to pop up right now, isn't it? Nope, nothing. We're getting, we're getting pretty close to the top here. Oh, calm down, please. Please calm down. Oh, my gosh. Don't die on me here. There you go. That's better. That's better, Ekroff. We've been on such a long and epic adventure together. You can't just die to some wind. <laughs> that would be foolish. Foolish, here we are. That looks like a wall with which I can learn a shout. Oh, but that's a dragon noise. There's a dragon. Is he a friend? Are you? Wow, really? Holy crap. I am Well, you're probably not going to teach me the shout to kill dragons, are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? Strunmach, well, uh, I wasn't expecting you to be a dragon. I am as my father Akatosh made me, <laughs> as are you, Dovahkiin. Tell me, it's kind of awkward. why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? I'm not I'm not trying to intrude on anyone's meditation. You see the thing is I need to learn the uh, dragon wren shout. Mind teaching me? Hmm. Drem patience. <laughs> there are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the dove. I see. Not until introduction. By long tradition, the elder speaks first. Uh. Hear my thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovaki. Uh oh. <laughs> what? Uh, I don't. Why do you intrude here if not for Tinvark? I don't expect to be able to match that. I do not expect to be able to match that. Okay, now what do I do? How you, you expect me to match that? Did you see what you did? I mean, did you witness that? All right, dude, I will we'll give this a shot, but I just don't, I'm not expecting much. I mean, I believe in myself and all, but <laughs> there's no way. There is no way. Fire breath. Is that, I guess so, huh? Yeah. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. I'll just make sure here I'm doing the right thing. Yeah, fire breath. He, need, he wants me to, he told me to do this. So you cannot blame me. Saying, saying, Ekroff, why would you breathe fire on this giant dragon? Well, you uh, yeah. Are you okay, I used it. That looked uh, terrible. Yes. That was, that was, that did not match what you did. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. Fair enough. So what's the deal? Ah. Uh, I have expected you, Broda. You would not come. What? I can't move around. I cannot move. 
do you seek your weapon against? Uh, okay. What? This is this is not. I I can't move. I'm trying to move. Trust me. All right. Why do you fly away? Uh, <laughs> how how did you come to know Dragonrend? Darn! I can't hear him. This is. Damn it! Damn it! It's Bethesda. This is not what is supposed to be happening. Okay. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I I'm I I don't know what <laughs> is supposed to be going on right now, but I'm assuming that this is not it. So tell me all these things. That I can't hear. Turn up my volume. Nope, I just hear wind. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Let's <laughs> just keep going. I am just going to have to tab through this. That is unbelievable. Why? What a fail that was. Are you gonna come down or what? What is going on? Dragon dude. Hello, hello. So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sauce, dragon blood. Right. What would you ask of me? Yeah, okay, here we go. Finally. My gosh, I need to learn the Dragon Ren shout. That was weird. I don't don't ask. Don't don't ask me, please. You have not answered my question. Why do you need to learn this thum? Right. Well, I need to stop Alduin. Yes, Alduin. Zemba. Zemba. The elder brother, gifted, grasping, and troublesome, as is so often the case with firstborn. Okay. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? Me? Myself? Uh, well, the thing is here... The prophecy says that I am the only... That only a dragonborn can stop him. That's what it says. Mm, true. But Kostid, prophecy, tells what may be, not what should be. Interesting philosophy with Kostid's Parthenox. Salo Ak. Just because you can do a thing does not always mean you should. That is very true. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez? Of fate. Uh, well, actually, now that you put it that way. No, I would like to debate philosophy with him. What better reason to act than to fill man? I don't believe in destiny. Um, I, I don't I don't want to pick any of these. <clears throat> Do you have a other option? Well, let me say I don't believe in destiny, but I will stop Alduin. And so perhaps your destiny will be fulfilled. Who can say? Who can say? Des Motmahus, even to the dove who ride the currents of time, destiny is elusive. Alduin believes that he will prevail with good reason. Rockmool. Rockmool indeed. And he is no fool, ni me, Rinnik Gutnol, far from it. He began as the wisest and most far-seeing of us all. That's a nice story, but... But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Thank you. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? I can't say that I do. Uh, <laughs> never say, I never thought about it, Parthenox, I'm sorry. This is the most sacred mountain in Skyrim, Zokravak Struma, the great mountain of the world. Beautiful. 
Here, the ancient tongues, the first mortal masters of the voice, brought Alduin to battle and defeated him. Using the Dragon Wren shout, is that? I mean, I, I have to assume that that's uh, what he used, right? Yep. Mm, yes and no. Uh, that's not an answer. News, Nikron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. Right, that makes sense, but. The Nords mm. of those days I'm so confused. used the Dragon Rend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. Ah, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Hmm. Are you saying that the ancient Nords sent Alduin forward in time? Here? Not intentionally. Ah, oh, those idiots! Some hoped he would be gone forever. Forever lost. Maye. Unbelievable. I knew better. Tigbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day. He would surface. And so here he comes. Now, Which is why what do we do? I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Wait, you mean he's going to be here? Uh, how does any of this help me? Tid Krent. Time was. Shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Teed Ahran, the Time Wound, with huge. the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to. Cast yourself back to the other end of the break. Ooh, that's exciting. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Great, now where's the scroll, dude? Yeah, you're not gonna tell me. Do you know where I can find the Elder Scroll? Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. Well, you are likely better informed than I. Thanks for the chat, I suppose. How about that Trust guy? Trust your instincts, Dovakin. Your blood will show you the way. Fair your enough. Greetings. Fair enough. Sum Ark Mora. A nice little chat there with a the dragon. And we learned a whole bunch of stuff about ourselves and the world and history and time and that is just glorious really truly it is so hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode I think it's interesting if nothing else I mean I that dragon dude was our friend and you know, there's probably some stuff hanging out up there I could probably check out and so close to the top of the mountain might as well climb it you guys really don't need to see that do you No, you probably don't care to either so thank you for watching this episode of our Skyrim let's play uh, next episode, we will be finding out about the Elder Scroll. Oh, that sounds awfully familiar. <laughs> yes, we will be finding out about the Elder Scroll as our good friend Ekroth pretty much grows a bit nearer to the end. I am almost certain that we are, are kind of close to the end of the main storyline. I, I don't really know that for sure, though. <laughs> I'm just kind of making it up. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for our next episode of the Skyrim Let's Play series as we continue to follow Ekroth on this glorious adventure. I will see you guys next time, and why don't we do this? Oh, this is a good, fun thing to do. Which one is it? I, how, who, not the lesser ward. That's not what I want. Elemental Fury, no. Clairvoyance, become, there it is. There you are, my pretty. All right, here we go.
There it is. How long does this last? I don't even remember. It's gonna make die right here. A little bit longer. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Good job. Good job. All right, one more try. Oh, that is not. Oh, oh, snap. Oh. 